Hey ya! Welcome back to the channel and Undertale. This is part three, I think. Um, and today we are in Waterfall. Uh, last video we beat Papyrus with the power of friendship, and now we are going to do that to many more. Um, anyway, uh, let's get, let's get right into it. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. I don't know why I had to save, but I did. All that gives my life validation is explaining the echo flower. No one can know. Never trust a flower. That's one of the constants of this world. Never trust a flower. That's one of the constants of this world. Thank you. Yo! Are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome. She's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. <laughs> what? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. I'm going to Groby's. Wanna come? Yeah. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. Over here. I know a shortcut. Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hiya, Sansy. Hey, Sans, weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? Nah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Here, get comfy. Whoops, watch where you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? Fries, a burger. I like burgers. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Groby, we'll have a double order of burg. So, what do you think? Of my brother? He is very cool. Of course he's cool. You'd be cool too if you were, if you wore that outfit every day. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Nah, I'm fine. More for me. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries real hard. Like how he keeps trying to be a part of the royal guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the royal guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. But the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's a uh, still a work in progress. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Yeah. So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes, when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? It's just 10,000 G. Yeah, 
Just kidding. Grill me. Put it on my tab. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. I love sands. I can't... Can't have the berg. Alright, and with that, we are back on our journey to the east, not to the west. Alright, we are back here. Let us continue. This is a box. You can put an item in or take an item out. Why would you, though? You can't use items when they're in the box. Sincerely, a box hater. Use the box. Yes. Uh, I don't need to take out anything. I think. Yeah, I'm just gonna continue. I can dodge rocks, so... Yeah. I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Huh? There's a camera behind the waterfall. Crazy. I totally don't know what that is. It's also this. Oop. There's a tutu lying on the ground here. Will you take it? You got the old tutu. Uh, let's see. Item. Info. Old tutu. Armor, defense 10. Finally, a protective piece of armor. Uh, I don't. Let's use it. You, bleh, you equipped the old tutu. Ooh. Hi, Undyne! I'm here with my daily report! Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier... Huh? Did I fight them? Uh, yes, of course I did! I fought them valiantly! What? Did I capture them? Well... No. I tried very hard, Undyne, but in the end... I failed. What? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But Undyne, you you don't have to destroy them. You see, you see. I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Oh. There she goes. Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome! I'm so jealous. What'd you do to get her attention? <laughs> Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. <laughs> feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. Thank you. One. Two. Three. And four. Let's go. Aaron flexes in. Aaron, attack 24, defense 12. This seahorse has a lot of 
HP. Horsepower. All of his attacks are harder to dodge at the bottom of the box. Check all you want. Aaron is splashing you playfully. <laughs> flex. You flex. Aaron flexes twice as hard. Attack increases for you too. Flexing contest? Okay. Flex more. Just winky, smiley face. Aaron is ready for your next flex. Flex. You flex harder. Aaron flex flexes twice, tr thrice as hard. Attack increases for you too. Nice, I won't lose though. Winky, smiley face. Yeah. Just sweat away from me. You flex. Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. You won! You earned zero XP and 30 gold. He flexed so hard, the change spilled out of his pocket. You failed the puzzle. <laughs> yeah, this just says, if an error is made, the bell blossom can recall bridge seeds back to where they started. Merp. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. <laughs> so, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a dusty tutu. Is that true? Are you wearing a dusty tutu? What will you say? Yes. So you are wearing a dusty tutu. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day. Click. A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes into the stars. Wait, yeah, their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now, all we have here are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. Wishing room. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Come on, sis. Make a wish. Washua shuffles up. Washua, attack 18, defense 5. This humble germaphobe seeks to cleanse the world- Wait, cleanse the, the whole world. Tweet whistle as it cleans. Uh. Washua is friends with a little bird. Clean. You ask Washua to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Clean means clean. Uh, uh, uh. Washua is rinsing off a pizza. You won! You earned 0 XP and 25 gold. I wish my sister and I will see the real stars someday. Look through the telescope? Yes. Check wall. Seems like it wants me to check the wall. Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. This one? No. Ancient writing covers the walls. 
You can just make out the words. The war of human and of humans and monsters. I can't read. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seems that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside the human body even after death. If a monster defeats a human, they can take it they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable unfathomable power. It is an illustration of a strange creature. There is something very unsettling about this drawing. You eat one half of the bicycle, your HP was maxed out. <laughs> and I, you suck! Ah! Get juked. Oh my god. Yo, did you see that? And then just touched me. I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky? If you were just standing a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. There they go. You know, I always thought there was something in there. Maybe I'm remembering things wrong. This cheese has been here for so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Squeak. Squeak. Knowing that the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the magical crystal, it fills you with determination. We save. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 50,000 G to use this premium telescope, but since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Use the telescope? Yes. Ugh. There's nothing here. Huh? You aren't satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. My face. My beautiful face. I relocated my store, but there's still no customers. Fortunately, I've thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a free ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. Ice cream, it's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 25G. Yes. Super, here you go. Your card's in the box. You got the ice cream.
No. Okay, so these boxes are different. Yeah, cool. What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? Maybe. Maybe I am, child. Hold on. Yes. No. Hold on. We're gonna save. Right here. Do, do, do. I like this part of the soundtrack. It's really nice. You hear a passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? Uh, didn't mean to do that again. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm, just one, but it's kind of stupid. Ooh. Mold small. I love that you- I love that you can just... Ignore those guys. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Yeah. Got the ballet shoes. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very murdery. But I bet that you knew that already. And because you already knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing. A dusty tutu. Because I knew, of course, after such a suspicious question, you would obviously change your clothes. You're such a smart cookie. That's... Wait, this way you're safe and I didn't lie. No betrayal anywhere. Being friends with everyone is easy. Oh. Poor soul. Washua and Aaron appear. Clean me. You ask Washua to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Oh. Oh. Stop sweating. No. Flex. Flex. I flexed so hard and spooked him out of the room. You hear passing- uh, I don't need to say that every time. Don't say that, come on, I promise I won't laugh. The power to take their souls. This is the power that the humans feared. Ooh. Hey there. Noticed you were here. I'm Onion Zen. Onion Zen, you here? You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You'll love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Even though the water's getting so shallow here. I, I have to sit down all the time, but... Hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city. And living in the crowded aquarium. Like all my friends did. 
And the aquarium's full anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though, you hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Hey, there. That's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In waterfall. Oh, there. There they go. I feel bad for Indian Sam. Must be hard. Sharon hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyway. Uh, check. Siren attack 19 and defense 0. Tone deaf. She's too ashamed to sing her deadly song. Hum hum. Sharon thinks about doing karaoke by herself. Hum. You hum a jazz ballad. Shiren follows your melody. Siri, 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 Mimi. Ow. Sharon seems much more comfortable singing along. And 30 gold. The northern room inside- wait. The northern room inside hides a great- wait. I'm sorry, I can't read. The northern room hides a great treasure. A haunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. And this power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. And an incredible power would be and an and an incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called the boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death, if only for a few moments. A human soul could absorb the soul. No, a human could absorb the soul. I can't read! Uh, but this has never happened. And now it never will. It's a statue. The structure at its feet seem dry. Please take one. Take an umbrella? Yes. You took an umbrella. You put the umbrella on the statue. Yes. Place the umbrella atop the statue. Inside the statue, a music box begins to play. Dot, up, left, dot, down, down. Okay. I forget. There's a piano here. Play it? Yes.
Okay. I'm just bad. I try to do it by ear rather than actually looking at the code. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Take. You're carrying too many dogs. Annoying dog. Dog. A little white dog. It's fast asleep. You put the dog on the ground. The dog absorbs the artifact. Man. The artifact is gone. I wanna know what that says. Guess I'll never know. Dog residue. Info. Dog residue. Dog item. Shiny trail left behind by a dog. Man. Take an umbrella. Yeah. Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome. Let's go. Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would want the bed every night. Knowing she was gonna beat me up. <laughs> So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt any innocent person. Nice view. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Put your umbrella and put up your umbrella and climb on my shoulders. Yo, yeah. put it back. You turn the umbrella. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. Oh. Thank you, monster kid. The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful, and us monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken, and countless monsters were turned to dust. The serene sound of a distant music box fills you with determination.
<laughs> you suck, Undyne. Get got. Never mind, I suck. I need to go up. Ow. Don't worry, I have the power of food and anime on my side. I'm also just getting careless. I died. <laughs> I'm dumb. You cannot give up just yet. Cyan, stay determined. Do 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 do. Yes, Mr. Dreamer, I'll stay determined. Face me, Undyne. Um, yeah, face me, Undyne. You missed. You <laughs> It sounds like it came from over here. Oh. You've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Cyan, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... Flower. Piles of garbage. There are quite a few brands you recognize. Just garbage. The waterfall here seems to flow from the ceiling of the cavern. Occasionally, a piece of trash will flow through and fall into the bottomless abyss below. Viewing this endless cycle of worthless garbage, it fills you with determination. Piles of garbage. 
Just garbage. You rest your hand on the rusted bike. Its horn wheezes a honk of despair. Doesn't really sound like a honk of despair to me. A beat up desktop computer. The inside is empty. Garbage. It's a cooler. It has no brand and shows no sign of wear. Inside are a couple of freeze-dried space food bars. Take one? Yeah. You got the astronaut food. It's a DVD case for an anime. Desperate claw marks cover the edges. A trash heap. Seems like a regular training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? Nah. You stare into each other's eyes for a moment. <laughs> Too intimidated to fight me, huh? I'm a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin used to live inside a dummy, too. Until you came along. When you talked to them, they thought they were in for a nice chat. But then, the things you said. Horrible, shocking, unbelievable. It spooked them right out of their dummy. Human, I'll scare your soul out of your body. Mad dummy blocks the way. Mad dummy, check. Mad dummy, attack 30, defense, yes. Because they're a ghost, physical attacks will fail. Feudal, feudal, feudal! Oh, you dummies! Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks. Hey, you, forget I said anything about magic. That dummy is looking nervous. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. No one is happy with this. I'll defeat you and take your soul. Ow. That dummy glares into a mirror, then turns to you with the same expression. I'll use your soul to cross the barrier. Uh. <laughs> that dummy is hopping mad. Stand in the window of a what you call it. I can't fucking read. Shit. HP was my. I didn't mean to do that. Then everything I want will be mine! That <laughs> tummy is getting caught in all over the dialogue box. Huh? Yeah, I I guess I'll avenge my cousin. My dummy is, uh... What was their name again? Whatever, whatever, whatever! Feudal, feudal, feudal! Bro. Bro's mad. Pitiful, pitiful, pitiful! I can't fucking read. I mean, my voice cracked, I meant. Feeble, feeble, feeble. Hey, guys! Dummies, dummies, dummies! Remember how he said not to shoot at me? 
Well, failures! You're fired! You're all being replaced! <laughs> now you'll see my true power! Relying on people that aren't garbage! Mechanical words fill the room. Dummy bots! Magic missile! Ow. That dummy is bossing around its bullets. Dummy bots, try again! That do dummy is doing an armless ska dance. Dummy bots, you're awful! Dummy bots, final attack! than the other guys who cares who cares who cares i don't need friends i've got knives i'm out of knives but that doesn't matter you can't hurt me and i can't hurt you you'll be stuck fighting me forever forever for Acid rain? Oh, forget it. I'm out of here. I'm sorry I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, your friend immediately left. Oh no, you guys looked like you were having a lot of fun. Oh no, I just wanted to say hi. Oh no. Well, I'm going to head home now. Oh, um, feel free to come with if you want. But no pressure. I understand if you're busy. It's fine. No worries. Just thought I'd offer. Hey, my house is up here. In case you want to see. Or in case you don't. You feel a calming tranquility. You're filled with determination. Alright. I am going to end it here for today. Uh, sorry that it took so long to upload uh, another episode, but uh, the holidays kept me busy, and also I am going to be working again. I'm gonna be flipping burgers right after this, actually. So things on this channel are just gonna be uh not slower if anything i'll be a little bit more active because i'll be wanting to do this more because i'd be so bored working um and also you know the holidays are over and as i said i'm gonna be more active uh this year uh anyway i'll probably talk more about this on live streams and stuff you, you know how i am um, anywho, I gotta get to work again. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. Um, I hope you have a wonderful day, night, or whatever time it is for you when you're watching this. And just remember to take care of yourself. Eat, sleep, drink, shower, I don't know. Just do anything that will make you feel good. Um, and yeah. As always... I'm always behind you, and I'll see you on the flip side. Bye-bye.